I'm Pastor Daryl McLaren and thank you so much for viewing. I want to speak to you for a few minutes concerning demonic activity in the hour in which we are living in. On another video on YouTube, I was talking about the signs of the time concerning tornadoes, uh, hurricanes, earthquakes, uh, floods, the things that we are now seeing taking place uh, within our world. I also mentioned that along with the natural things that take place in our earth, there is a spiritual parallel. Anytime you see high activity in storms, tornadoes, floods, earthquakes, there is also a high activity in the demonic realm. The demonic realm is here within this world to do the works of evil. Satan has come to kill, steal, and to destroy. When you see the activity, as right now the floods, the natural floods are taking place, destruction, thousands of homes are being destroyed. Now, in God's Word, we are convinced and proven that storms, floods, these type things does not come from God. Because when Jesus was in the boat with his disciples, Jesus rebuked the storm. Jesus would not rebuke something that was of God. Now God uses circumstances to cause people to come to the realization of where they are and what they are doing. In other words, examine yourself. See what's taking place in your life. But we know that this is signs of evil and the Satan has come to kill, steal, and to destroy. I want to caution you concerning this summer. We not only will see natural things take place within our nation, I believe we are going to see major earthquakes right here in the United States. I believe the hurricane season will be one of the worst that America has ever witnessed before. But I am speaking about demonic activity. I want you to be very cautious concerning what you do and how you involve yourself with things because we are seeing more demonic activity now than we have seen in our nation. What is this all about? Demons, the first choice, listen to this, the first choice of a demon is to possess a person. To cause that person to live evil and to do evil, to think evil and to talk evil. That is the concept of evil spirits. There can be many evil spirits live in one body. There can be demonic powers that drives men and women to do things that is unheard of. I want you to prepare yourself this summer and this coming fall. We will see demonic activity within the lives of people and you will hear it reported on the news of unheard of events, uh, people being murdered, people being captured, kidnapped, tortured. People uh, in mass numbers, their lives being taken. 
Why is that? It is because demonic activity is increasing within our own nation. Demonic activity is something that Christian people must continually be aware of. We are in a situation within our nation that we know as Christian people, as the coming of the Lord draws closer and closer, we know that the devil is ramping up his attack upon God's people and upon the people that he is controlling. We need to prepare there are going to be many, many strange things happen this summer. I'll also touch on something for just a moment that I'll be covering in another video. There will be signs. There will be signs and wonders in the heavens. There will be signs here in the United States that I believe uh, demons are going to be creating. There is an ability that demons have that they can create and they can cause things in the supernatural realm to take place. We have all seen the television programs on TV where people are uh, supposedly looking for ghosts and uh, evil things. There is an ability in the evil realm that we must be very cautious of. As Christian people covered by the blood of Jesus Christ, we are protected, but we cannot open ourselves up to demonic activity. We cannot open ourselves up to astrology fortune telling, palm reading. I'm going to be covering this subject at another time, but right now I'm talking to you about demonic activity. I have recently talked with people that have experienced unusual things taking place in their home that they did not understand. I have dealt with many people that their homes had demonic activity on a continual basis. There's been homes here in Asheville, North Carolina that we have prayed over and commanded demon spirits to leave the home. I am telling you as a caution from a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, we will see great demonic activity. There will be such strange things taking place within our world and within our nation. And people will not be able to explain it. There will be no explanation. But it will simply be because we have now entered into a time. Listen to me for the next moment. The kingdom of heaven is coming down. The kingdom of heaven is being established on earth by God's chosen people. This is the reason we are approaching the end time and the activity of demons is increasing. I challenge you in the name of Jesus to continually plead the blood over your life. Walk a holy life and keep your eyes open to demon activity. And don't allow the devil to deceive you that you can play with the devil with one hand and with God with the other. It cannot be. God is a jealous God and He wants all of you. Let's watch Let's pray and let's be cautious of demonic activity in the very moment that we are living in.